Hey, good morning, FGG. Good Monday morning. Hey, um, let's hit this really, really quickly. As you know, we are now in peak. And being in peak means that everything's gonna be a little bit more challenging. Uh, routes will be bigger, yeah, what expectations are greater. Um, the need for everybody to just focus and do their jobs is gonna be critical. Um, also, the need for everybody to be here is critical. Uh, we already been challenged because of COVID, because people have to be on a, a COVID list, meaning that they have to either be in quarantine or they actually have it themselves. Um, so we have that challenge. And wearing masks are critical now. The Amazon's come to the conclusion that they're going to give tear infection for every mask. Uh, if somebody get caught without wearing a mask while they're delivering, whether you see a customer or not. So they got a ring doorbell and they see you and they put on that survey you weren't wearing a mask. That's going to count against you. Um, it's not up for debate. It's not a discussion. No one has to agree. It is just what it is. Um, so I need everybody to make sure you focus, that you wear your mask, drive safely. We've had three accidents in, in three days, um, all of which was caused by us. Um, so it's, it's uh, just not something that we can continue to go on and do. It's not something I can just accept. So make sure you're driving safe, that you're paying attention. It's wet out. It'll be wet out for the probably the remainder of this peak season. So you got to drive carefully and safely. You got to pay attention to your surroundings. Uh, and in the dark, you know, when it's wet and it's dark too, you got that challenge. But that's the job. Um, you know, I've heard some people saying, well, I'm trying to get done by 6 so I know how to work too late in the dark. It doesn't work that way. Uh, we, we, got, we work until our work is done. So it's going to be different for a few people. And one of the things I want to make sure you all understand because we're in peak, I, I can't accept unreliable people. And I, so I want to make sure I'm clear about this. If you call off on me twice during the peak period, I'm going to let you go um, because I can't deal with unreliable people. Uh, right now, you know, the people are customers, that is, need their packages, want their packages bad for various reasons, holiday season, things of that nature. Amazon's restrictions on us are so much greater uh, during this time. We cannot fail during peak. Uh, you fail during peak, you, you don't get to keep your contract. So I can't take the risk. So if you're calling off on us, uh, we're going to let you go because it's better to not have you at all and me project Lord numbers than to project numbers and you not show up. So I just want to be clear about that. It doesn't make a difference what the circumstances that surrounds it. If you call out twice during peak, uh, we'll talk. Most likely you'll be gone. And most likely means you'll be gone. So... Uh, and that started yesterday. Uh, truthfully, peak started on Friday, but but as of yesterday, I'm accounting for every person who's called off. Just can't can't deal with it. There was a problem during the year. Um, this term being late too. You got to be on time. We're gonna have to start dealing with that too, because we got to get in the warehouse on time. Make sure you know what wave you're on. Make sure you're in that warehouse on time, because uh, it sets the whole station back when we're running late. Uh, so just not gonna accept any excuses. Don't mean to be a downer, but I want to be up front with you so nobody's surprised when they find out what happens or what happens to somebody who you, who you like. Because it's not going to be a, make a difference who the person is. You don't do what you're supposed to do. you got to remove you. you. can't fail during peak. I do thank you all for all you do. And I uh, hope you're having a, have a wonderful day today. I, God, I ask you to watch over and protect them, each and every one of them, not just them, but their families. I pray you would bless them but the only kind of blessings that only you can provide. This time of the year can be different for a lot of people. Some people are very joyous. Some people are living in the memory of people who they love. I pray you give comfort and peace. I thank you for each person. I pray your blessings and your protection. In Jesus' name, amen.